How's it going everybody and welcome back for another Minecraft parkour map. This is Top by Vacton, I believe. I hope I'm saying that correctly. And our goal in this map is to parkour our way all the way from the very depths of the world to the very top. And it looks like a lot of fun. Very calm, cozy, relaxing parkour. Lovely themes. It's everything I look for because I'm bad, so it should be a fun map, and I hope you all enjoy. So we're just gonna sit back, listen to some music, have a chill time, admire the view, and do some jumping on some blocks. I love that it's seeming like a fairly straightforward map so far. That's always a good indication that I'm actually gonna have a good time with it. Because if it's got a lot of like, oh well, there are nine different ways to go, figure out the correct one. It always kind of uh, bums me out a little bit. Oh, well that's not quite what I was expecting there. Love that. I... Yeah, damn. Worth a shot. Go around. I like the nether theme here. I've never done any builds in the nether or anything like that. Never gone out of my way to do anything with it. Let me know if you think I should in a series sometime soon because, well, some of these look super cool and I would love to experiment with that a little bit at some point. Any of you who watch my hardcore series. Well, damn, why'd I go and do that? this end up looping around the correct way? No, I doubled all the way back. Let's not do that. Then Geronimo to here, all the way around again. There we go, much better. Don't miss any silly jumps. Perfect. And where am I going here? Oh, I almost missed the red brick stairs because they blended in so well. Got a lot of gold blocks. Got to raid the piglin supply chambers. Their treasury. Then I guess up here. Yeah, that looks correct. Up we go. Oh, I like the colors here. The the crimson wood with the uh, the nether brick looks really good. What does an emerald one do? Diamonds? Oh, it gives me jump boost. What do I need jump boost for? Do I gotta go hop this fence? Yes, okay. I like it. I wonder how many sections this map is gonna have. If you think about it, we're climbing from the very bottom of the world, starting in the nether, all the way to, I assume, the very tippity top. So if we're gonna do that, it's probably got to have a deep slate area. Maybe like a lush cave or something, a normal cave system, an overworld, and then a sky, I guess. Maybe a cloud area or like a space-themed section. I don't know. I feel like this could be a decently long map. Especially if I do that. Silly mistakes.
Then, oh, do I have to jump down in this hole? Oh, it looks like there's slime blocks down there, okay. There we go. Then Geronimo, where to now? Oh, across this bottom layer, love it. Climb our way up and out. Nice. You know, I won't lie, I've been really considering going and buying a new Xbox because I'm very excited about the fact that all of the old Call of Duties are getting a little bit of a revival. And I think it could be a lot of fun to maybe go back and try just playing through a little bit, having some fun on multiplayer on those old school games and seeing how it is. So if you would be interested in seeing that, let me know. You might sway me into spending a little bit of money. I feel like we've got to be coming up on the end of the nether theme now. We've been going for quite a while now. We've done every section, really. We had kind of a basalt area. We've had a crimson. We've had these. All the creeping clusters or whatever you want to call them. Let me in. Thank you. Some big lava filled rooms, a little bit of soul sand, you know, some bones. I feel like we're coming up on the end sometime here pretty quick. Now we're getting a little bit of a glowstone. Well, that didn't quite work out in my favor. Ow, ow. Let's try that again, shall we? Oh, glowstone, take two. There we go, much better. And what's through the portal? I like that, that's a really cool transition. Okay, very pleased with that. Ooh, snake parkour. Okay. What I really want is a cool parkour map that is entirely made out of moving parts. If you have any ideas for a good one like that, let me know. Because I remember I played one where you had to parkour across moving boats and a couple other things, and it was just a lot of fun. I'm easily entertained by moving pieces, so... Oh, there we go. Finally, another checkpoint. The lava's so loud here. Oh, here we go. Leaving the nether. Okay. Where am I at now? Ooh, dripstone cave. Okay. I like it. You're missing out, there's no glow squid down here. Okay, moving on to like a kind of lush cave area. Damn it, hold up, wait a minute, don't do that. I figure we're gonna have a couple different smaller themes inside of the deep slate theme, the kind of the same way we did with the nether. And then we'll go into a larger cave theme. And I really don't think there's too much that could be done with the overworld. What did that do? That was so loud. Oh, I think it opened this gate. Unless it was open before and I just missed it. No, it wasn't, okay. Climb that. 
What are we looking at next? Please, okay, there we go. Ooh, Elytra, I love Elytra portions. No, I'm too low. Try to stay a little higher this time. There we go. Where to next? I really should look and find some cool Elytra maps that are just like flying through obstacle courses and stuff like that. I'm sure there's a bunch. And uh, Elytras are just fun. It's just not loading. I was like, what was that bright light over there? Oh, I like the look of this. This is a dark city inside the caves here. Oh, this is a really cool design. I like that a lot. I'm sure parkour maps aren't where most people go for build inspiration, but I feel like every time I play one, it's like, oh, I want to include this in a world I'm doing. I want to do that someday. And I feel like if I ever do, it's just gonna make my world a messy, just clusterfuck. And I'm kind of about it, honestly. Just to build cool shit for the sake of building cool shit. Wait a minute. There we go. I was eyeing the slime block jump and my brain stopped working for a second. It was like, hey, how's that going to function? I can't reach that. I was not supposed to. Damn it, I walked off the edge. There we go. Can I make that? Okay, I can. Good. Had me worried there for a second. Don't want to miss any checkpoints. Please don't make me redo progress game. I'd much rather not. One thing I have noticed is that playing parkour maps makes me realize that I'm a bit of a dick. Everywhere that I see things, it's like, oh, well, what if I put a trap there to mess with people just to piss people off when they play? I probably should never get into map building for that reason. Ow. I feel like I hit the corner of that. 
Although, because apparently 1.20 fixed uh, the corners of slime blocks being glitched, I, uh, I can be pretty confident that I'm just missing twice in a row now. There we go, much better. Take me up to the next layer. Oh, not even. That works too. I feel like we're probably getting close to the end of the underground area. The first section was about 500 seconds, 500 ticks, whatever it is. 500 seconds, I think. So this one should be get coming up on the end too, if they're the same length. And then we can see what's in store for us next. Maybe, possibly. Well, that's a long double slime bounce. Ooh, minecart. Take me away. Oh, this one looks like it's going to be a little crazy, huh? Oh, I guess I should keep going. It's probably going to be the same thing where I got to outpace it. Okay, there we go. I was almost too slow there because I was just watching it. Where am I going from here? I guess up there, maybe? Yeah, that should be right, I think. Oh, now these areas are getting a little confusing, huh? Well, damn, I landed it and then I walked off the edge. Why would I do such a thing? If I went this way, nothing. Listen, lava, chill out. Not interested, you're loud, you're scary. Oh, can I jump off the top of the slime? Oh, that's fun. I like that a lot. Well, that doesn't seem right. Hold up. I almost completely skipped over the water elevator. Damn, this cave section is long. Oh, did that change behind me? 
Oh, I feel like the world changed behind me whenever I reached the end of that. What the hell? Where am I supposed to be going from here? Oh, I am supposed to be up here. Okay. Oh, is this it? This the next area? Taking us above ground? Yeah, it is. Okay. Oh, wait. Is this the end? Oh. Okay. That was not quite what I was expecting, I'm going to be honest. I thought for sure we were going to have an above ground section. Three stars, probably fair. I can't argue with that too much. Now, does this teleport me all the way back down? Oh, no! And after I worked so hard to escape, too. What a shame. All right, well, this map was a lot of fun. I thoroughly enjoyed it. We did make it all the way to the top. Uh, this map had some very similar themes to the previous parkour map that we played. And I suppose that's because it was helped... Or... The same person who made the last map helped create it, so that's a lot of fun. So thank the both of them for a fantastic map, and I hope you all enjoyed. That being said, please like the video, leave a comment, and subscribe to the channel, and I will see you all next time.